Cause he held me close me. So I wouldn't let go This morning I thank you for your mercies I didn't let go So I'm here today Join us if the Lord has kept you safe. I'm alive today, only because of Jesus. We say, Oh, yeah. He kept me. God kept me. Yeah. God this kept is why you lift your hands and say, He kept me. to lift up your hands as a sign of surrender somebody begin to declare oh lord in this weekend of mercy show me mercy come on just lift up your hands it is a weekend of mercy i want you to open your mouth and say oh lord show me mercy somebody say i am a seed of mercy i cannot be destroyed i will survive come on lift up your voice say i am a seed of mercy I cannot be destroyed. I will survive. I will survive. I will survive. Somebody say, Oh Lord, show me mercy. Oh Lord, show me. Open your mouth and begin to pray for 30 seconds. To those that are watching us live from around the world, you're watching us live from North America. You are in Canada, Australia. You're watching us live uh, from Australia, New Zealand, all over Europe, Asia, the Middle East, all over the continent of Africa. Share this broadcast and declare, I am a seed of mercy. Somebody say, I am a seed of mercy. I, am a I cannot be destroyed. I, cannot I be will destroyed. survive. I will Somebody survive. say, I am a seed of mercy. I, am a seed of I mercy. cannot be destroyed. I cannot be I will survive. I will survive. Somebody say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Somebody say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Show me mercy. 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 Anything that was following you before this service that is not of God. Yes. We commanded to catch fire in the name of Jesus. Yes. We yes. declare in this service. Yes. Let the mercy of God locate your destiny. Yes. I declare every chapter of pain. Every chapter of affliction. Every chapter of sickness. It is coming to an end in this service. Le paragadeshka la bragadoska. Zi paragadeshka la bragadoska. Zi paragadeshka. The Lord is showing you mercy in your family. The Lord is showing you mercy. I want you to open your mouth and pray that prayer pointer. Le paragadeshka la bragadoska. Somebody say, Oh Lord, show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Somebody say, Oh Lord, in this service, Lord, in deliver, this service. Me. Deliver, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. from every valley, from every valley that, I that I am in, any situation that represents a valley, oh God of mercy, arise and pull me out, arise and pull me out, pull my family out of every valley, out of every valley, by your mercy, by your mercy, by your mercy. By your mercy, by your mercy, by your mercy, by your mercy.
I declare in this service yes. by the mercies of God, yes. by the compassion of God, oh, yes. every generation of cast be broken now. Le paragados ka magadesh ka la bragados, zi paragadesh ka la bragados ka, zi paragadesh ka la bragados, zi paragadesh ka la bragados ka, zi kadesh ka la bragados, zi paragadesh ka la bragados ka, zi paragadesh ka. Any pattern of moving forward and moving backward at the same time, oh, yes. I declare catch fire. catch fire. I want somebody to just open your mouth. Whatever you can be living God for, I want you to release it by the mercies of God. Open your mouth for 30 seconds. Worship Him. Can you give us this song? I'm the one that God has shown mercy. Open your mouth, somebody, for 30 seconds. Shalabroska magadesh kalabroska. Can I have some water? You have shown me mercy. You have shown me mercy. Lord, I'm the one. You have shown me mercy. You have shown me mercy. You have shown me mercy. I'm the one. Say, I'm the one. You have shown me mercy. You have shown me mercy. You have, you have shown me mercy. Say I'm the very one, Lord. I'm the one. You have shown me mercy. You have shown me. You have shown me You have shown me. You have shown me mercy. You look beyond me, oh. You look beyond me, oh. Oh, you look past my sin, my shame, everything that I was and kept me love. You look beyond me, oh. You look beyond me. You have Thank you, Holy Ghost. Father, in this service, Jesus. I decrease that you may increase. Yes, Lord. Lord, I disappear that you may appear. Yes. Give me the unction to function. In the name of the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, shout amen. amen. You may be seated in the presence of God. I just want you to lift up your hands wherever you are. In this second prophetic Sunday, I sense it in the realm of the spirit. Yes. Something is about to happen. Just Jesus. lift up your hands as you're seated. Shalabroska magadesh kalabraske. Zegedesh kalabragadoska zegedesh. Band, I can't hear you. Zelebraska magadesh kalabraske. Zeparagadeshka. Ziparagadeshka labragados. Zeparagadeshka labros. Zegedeshka labragadoska zegedesh. There is a wave of mercy. There is a flow of mercy. I saw somebody in the realm of the spirit. Your son is scheduled to go for an operation. The name of your son is Patrick. I need to pray over the life of your son. You are here. I want you to make your way to the altar. I saw your son scheduled to go for an operation. Somebody lift up your hand and say, Jesus is the healer. Jesus, Jesus is, is the, the healer. healer. Somebody say, Jesus is the great physician. Jesus, Jesus is the great physician. Come on, say, Jesus is the miracle worker. Jesus, Jesus is, is the miracle worker. What is your name, mom? Your name is Catherine. Because I saw... Your son scheduled to go for an operation. What is the name of your son? Patrick Monene. Your, your, your son's name is who? Patrick Monene. Patrick Monene. Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. It's like ECC, you are not ready for the... Uh, are you ready? Prophesy. Somebody say prophesy.
prophesy. Prophesy. Oh. Sing for one minute. Come on. Lift your hands. Say Jesus is the healer. Jesus, Jesus is the healer. Somebody say Jesus is the great physician. Jesus, Jesus is the great physician. Jesus is the miracle worker. Jesus, Jesus is the miracle worker. I still can't feel this monitor as well. Now listen, Mama. I saw your son scheduled to see a surgeon on Tuesday. When is your son supposed to see the surgeon? On Tuesday. On Tuesday. But I want you to know, Dr. Street, but it's Jesus that heals. Yes. I want you to stretch your hands. Because what God cannot do does not exist. Yes. The Lord will show your son mercy. Oh, yes. The Lord will show your son mercy. Yes. The Lord will show your son mercy. Yes. I cancel every plan. Every plot, every scheme of the devil. Yes. I use her as a point of contact. Yes. Anyone here, anyone watching, you are sick in your body. I decree and declare in the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. From the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Wow. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Any sickness that has defied medical diagnosis. Yes. I declare the blood of Jesus is against it. Amen. I command tumors dissolve. dissolve. High blood pressure dissolve. dissolve. Blood Blood clots be healed. be healed. Every form of infirmity, heart failure, my God, cancers Blood be reversed by the mercy of God. Oh, yes. The Lord is telling me, Your son will live and he will be a testimony of what God can do. Come closer. Can I have the oil? Stretch your hands towards her. Oh, Shalabraska, Zegedeshka. God is going to remember your son. I am counting one, two in the realm of the spirit. How many children do you have? You have two children. Yes. God is remembering your children. As for you and your as for you and your children, I hear the Lord say, You are for signs and wonders. You are for signs and wonders. You are for signs and wonders. Shalabroska Magadesh Kalabraski Zegedeshka. I saw somebody. You are praying for God to bring Gibson back. It is like a brother. You are praying for God to bring Gibson back. Prophesy. I need to pray for you. You are saying, oh Lord, bring Gibson back. You are crying in the realm of the spirit. And you are saying, oh Lord, bring Gibson back. Bring Prophesy. Gibson back. Bring Gibson back. Mm. Bring Gibson Shwaza back. Open. Who is Gibson? That is your brother. I saw him in captivity. And the Lord is telling me, I saw him under bondage. But the Lord is setting him free. And the Lord is reconnecting him back to the family. Yay! Somebody stretch your hands towards her. The Lord is remembering you. Stand here. Shalabroska. What is your name? Your name is Margaret. The Lord is about to change your life. And the Lord is about to restore your brother. Who is from Kirinyaga? I'm from Kirinyaga. You are from Kirinyaga. Yay! Any witchcraft altar Prophesy. that is fighting and contending with your destiny yes. from this altar of fire oh, yes. in this prophetic yes. Sunday, yes. I command it catch fire, 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 catch fire. Stretch your hands towards them. Something is happening in the realm of yes. the spirit as God is touching your son Patrick, uh -huh. my God. I also, I counted one, two. You said you have two children. I'm also counting one, two. How many children do you have? Two. You also have two children. Somebody said prophesy. Prophesy. In the realm of the spirit, as God is healing, as God is healing, Shalabroska Magadesh. Oh, yes. Zagadesh, Kalabragadoska, Zagadesh. As God is healing the son, yes. I am seeing somebody crying about the mother. It is like your mother has a blood clot. Labroska. I'm hearing a name. Your name is Doris. Mm. And you are crying concerning your mother. Come, I need to pray for you. Shalabroska Magadesh. Power. What is your name? Your name is who? Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. What is wrong with your mother? She had a blood clot on her brain. Just stretch your hands. Oh, Shalabroska. I just feel I need to pray for healing. I want you at this moment, everybody stand up on your feet. Begin to pray. Anyone sick in your family, anyone sick, your loved one, anyone connected to you, begin to pray for them for 30 seconds. Even those that are watching us, by the mercies of God, I release the healing virtues of Christ. The Bible says by his stripes we are healed. We are made whole by the blows that he received. 
I want you to pray this prayer points after me. Somebody say I cancel every bad clinical report. Every bad clinical in the name of Jesus. Every bad clinical report. Every bad clinical report. Be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Somebody say every sickness in my body. Every sickness in my body. Die from the roots. Die from the roots. Sit down. As I am praying for you, Shalabroska, please stand up because I want to anoint you as a point of contact. Who is Joyce? Come. Who is Joyce? My mom. That is your mother. Who is Virginia? Your mother. Because I saw your mother. Your mother is sick. What is happening to your mother? She has a blood pressure. She also has diabetes. Uh huh. Yeah. High blood pressure and diabetes. Yes. Because I saw your mother sick. I saw her mother sick. Do you know each other? Shalabroska. Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. Today your case will be addressed. Power. Your matter shall be settled. Oh, yes. I am just seeing the mercy of God prevailing over sickness and disease. There is a wave of healing. Shalabroska magadesh kalabraska. The Lord is telling me to tell you, it shall be well with you. It shall be well with your son. Patrick will be a man of God. He will be a vessel of honor. Amen. Who is Winfred? My daughter. That is your daughter. My firstborn. Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. God is remembering you. God is remembering your family. Shalabroska magadesh kalabraska. Oh, zegedeshka. Lepragadoska. The Lord is telling me he's going to stand with you and your children. I am seeing a marriage, but I'm seeing the devil interfering. The Lord is going to fight for you. The Lord, what do you want God to do? I want to settle with my life. I need money to take care of my 
family and my children have suffered. God is saying he's going to take care of you. God is saying he's going to take care of you. Because I see a man walking with you. But in 2016, I see him going to another direction. But thus saith the Lord God of Israel. I will never leave you. I will never forsake you. You are a seed of mercy. You cannot be destroyed. God is opening your doors. God is opening financial gates and financial doors. Go and succeed. Go and prosper. As you take Patrick to the doctors, we decree and we declare yes. a good report. Amen. You are coming back with a testimony. Yes. He will be a man of God and a voice to the nations. Amen. And God will use him mightily in the healing ministry. Amen. And so shall it be. God has remembered you. And the Lord is healing your husband. He's restoring the health of your husband. I see new open doors. Shalabroska. I hear John. Who is John? My husband. That is your husband. The Lord is touching him. For and sure. the Lord is opening a door. There is a promotion that is coming your way. Between now and the month of July, I am seeing a promotion. I am seeing open doors. Le Pragadesh Kalabragados. Ziparagadesh Kalabroska. Zikidesh Kalabroska Magadeshka. Rapakadoska Magadeshka. I release the mantle of Deborah over your life. God will use you. God will use you. Amen. God will use you. And God tells me to tell you, where you are despised is where you shall be raised. Where you suffer the most is where you will shine the brightest. Amen. The Lord is going to contend with anyone that contends against you. The Lord will fight them that fights against you. I decree and declare, you are blessed. Your marriage is blessed. Your family is blessed. Your children are blessed. I declare the restoration of your brother. Keeps on wherever you are. I release restoration with compensation. A hundredfold. And so shall it be. Amen. 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 Where is your mother now? She's at home. She's with my grandmother. Limuru. Do you know that God is able to touch your mother? Somebody say what God cannot do. What what God tell God your neighbor what God cannot do. What God, God cannot, cannot do. It does not exist. Does not does not exist. exist. I see you in pain and in tears. But God is remembering your family. Who was in Lebanon? Because I'm seeing in the realm of the spirit. From 2021. I am seeing you in Lebanon. To 2022 November. In actual sense I am seeing the 28th of November. That is when it's like uh, you came back. Shalabroska Magadesh. The Lord says the closing of one door is the opening of another door. Amen. And as God raised Esther from nothing, you are the deliverer. You are Amen. the Esther of your family. Amen. That God will raise as a deliverer. Come and stand here. Bring the oil. Shalabroska Magadesh. Stretch your hands towards her. Somebody say, I am the deliverer of my family. I am the deliverer of my family. A prophecy for one is a prophecy for all. Somebody say, I will break the barriers of my family. Somebody say, I am a line crosser. I am a line crosser. I am a territory taker. I am a territory taker. God is remembering you and your siblings. God is remembering you and your siblings. I'm counting from you. I'm seeing one. Then I'm seeing two, three. How many are you in the family? Three. You are three. Shalabroska Magadesh. Zegedesh Kalabras. I declare a new beginning. I use you up as a point of contact for your mother. I declare, so shall it be. Deliverance from generational patterns. Every bloodline cast in your lineage. I terminate it by the blood of Jesus. And so shall it be. Somebody lift up your hands. Glory to Jesus. I am singing the realm of the spirit. Shalabroska Magadesh. I am seeing your father. You are here, but the Lord is telling me to use you as a point of contact for your father. I'm seeing your father is scheduled to go for an interview. And I pray for anyone here. I'm seeing the third of July. Your father is scheduled to go for an interview. And this is the door that God is going to use to, to, to usher him to the next level. I'm seeing the third of July. And I need to pray for you. I'm hearing a name like mercy. Uh -huh. I need to use you to pray for your father. Come to the altar. Or if you're watching us online. Anyone that is scheduled to go for any kind of interview. Yes. Whether it is a job interview, yes. a visa interview. Oh, yes. I decree and declare yes, favor. 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 Touch three people, tell them favor. favor. What is your name? Masi. 
Your name is Mercy. What is this interview I'm seeing on the 3rd of July? My father is scheduled to go for an interview. Your father is scheduled to go for an interview. Shalabros, come on. Somebody say prophesy. Prophesy. My eyes are open. Power. Prophesy. I am seeing the 3rd of July. Then I am seeing Tanzania. What is the connection to Tanzania? Uh, my father was was uh, was told to go to the interview in Tanzania on the 3rd of July. Somebody shall prophesy. Oh, oh, prophesy. Oh, oh, oh. The Lord is going ahead of him. Amen. I am seeing the favor of God. His doors are open. And the doors of your family are open. open. Bring the oil. Stretch your hands towards her. Shalabros Kamagadesh Ziparagados Kamagadesh Le Paragados Kamagadesh Zegedesh Kalabraska Le Paragados I am also seeing there is a mantle that is coming upon somebody. The mantle, I am seeing a mantle. You need to serve God. There is a calling of God on your life. And the Lord says, don't run away from your calling. I see, you know, if it is your calling, it will keep calling you. Turn to your neighbor, tell them if it's your calling. If it's your calling. It will keep calling you. It will keep calling you. Yeah, look at your neighbor, tell them if it's your calling. If it's your calling. It will keep calling you. It will keep calling you. You cannot escape. Touch three people, tell them you you cannot escape. You, you cannot, cannot escape. escape. Somebody say, I will not escape. I will, I will not, not escape. escape. I heard a name like Robert. Then I heard a name like Mboro. I need to speak over your life. Because I am hearing in the realm of the spirit. You are a young man. But I'm seeing the calling of God on your life. I don't want you. I want you to listen to me very well. How old are you? 14. You are 14 years. Yes. In the realm of the spirit. God called me into the ministry at an early age of nine years. And there is something I need to tell you. You need to live your life and you need to live for Christ. Because God has an agenda for your life. And I'm seeing the mantle that was upon your mother. I'm seeing that mantle coming upon your life. And I'm seeing in the realm of the spirit, I'm hearing the cry of your mother because of you. And the Lord is saying, you need to live for God. What happened to your mother? My mother passed on. To she passed on. Yeah. What was she doing before she passed on? She was a bishop at Kasarov. Prophesy. Somebody said prophesy. Prophesy. Oracle of God. Can I prophesy? Prophesy. Your destiny shall not be wasted. Amen. And anyone that Satan has planted around you. Yes. To lead you to a path of destruction. Because you are an extension of your mother's legacy. Oh yes. The Lord is saying where your mother did not go, you will go. Power. Where your mother did not reach, you will reach. Receive it. Can I go deeper? Go deeper, oh, oracle of God. Everybody lift up your hands and say, I declare. I declare. The destiny of my children will not be wasted. The destiny of my children will not be wasted. Somebody say, my children. My children. Are an extension of my legacy. Are an extension Somebody of my legacy. say, I declare. I declare. My children. My children. Will serve God. Will serve God. All the days of their life. All the days of their life. Of their life. You will serve God. And you will be a voice to the nation. Your mother was a woman of God here. But you will be a voice to the nations. Stretch your hands towards this young man. As I am anointing you. God is going to keep you. God is going to watch over you. Amen. And I need you to check. As you are living your life even as a young man. I want you today. Have you decided? I want you to make that conscious decision that I will live for God. Have you decided? Somebody say, I will live for God. I will live for God. You know, when God calls you, he doesn't call you based on what you can do. Yes. He calls you based on what he can do through uh -huh. you. Come on. Two things, even when you are no longer in this earth that speak for you. Your prayers and your sacrifices. They speak for generations. Somebody shout fire. 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 The prayers you pray and the sacrifices you offer to God. They speak for you. Even when you are no longer on this earth. Right. Somebody shout fire. 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 I heard the cry of your mother. Zopaska Magadesh Kalabraski. Oh, Zegedesh. I declare, as your father is going for that interview, I use you as a point of contact. I decree and declare his doors are open. 
in the name of Jesus. Somebody say, I refuse to be refused. I refuse to be refused. I deny to be denied. I deny to be denied. Touch three people, tell them, refuse to be refused. Refuse to be refused. Deny to be denied. Deny to be denied. Lift your hand and shout, fire. Fire. I saw you in the realm of the spirit. And I'm seeing you. Le Bragadeshka. I'm seeing you like uh, you are surrounded by nurses. But you, they are wearing like nurses. But you are not wearing as a nurse. What are you doing? I am doing nursing as a course. You are doing nursing as a course. Prophesy. Somebody say prophesy. prophesy. The Lord is saying that you will complete. You will start and you will complete. You are in what year? Right you are in second year right now. Somebody say completion. Completion. Somebody say completion. completion. Because I'm saying there is a resistance in the realm of the spirit for you not to finish this course. But the Lord is saying you need to complete this course. Because this course is going to open doors for you. I'm seeing you after the completion of this course. I'm seeing you in the United States of America. Prophesy. That will be your place of divine assignment. That will be your place of operation. Yes. It will be your place of divine assignment. Come on. Somebody shout fire. fire. As I anoint you, bring the oil. I declare completion. I bless you. In the name of Jesus. Young man, as I have served God from my young age. Look at me. You can be youthful and you can be useful. It is not the age that breaks the yoke. It is the anointing that breaks the yoke. I decree and declare. May God preserve you. I raise the canopy of grace and protection over your life. I declare where your mother did not go, where she did not reach, you will reach. The mantle is on you. And I declare from my young age, God will use you. Somebody say, I receive. I receive. Be seated in the presence of God. Amen. Wave your hand and say, oh Lord. Oh Lord. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Wave your hand and say, Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Show me mercy. Show, show me mercy. mercy. Say, Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Show me mercy. Show, show me mercy. mercy. I want you to hold a prophetic seed for this prophetic Sunday. To say, Oh Lord, I am entering into covenant with you. I am entering into covenant with you by my sacrifice. Concerning my request in this service. Whatever I want you to name your seed. Name your seed wherever you are. I want you to hold that seed. If it's on your mobile device. I want you to check the ministry and person number. And the ministry. The ministry pay bill number if you want to give on pay bill. If your seed is on your bank card. There is a kingdom hostess here with the PDQ machine. If you are sowing your seed uh, via. Uh, you have it you will also bring it to the altar i want you to hold something to those that are watching us live from around the world you have your prophetic seed you can give on paypal you can give on web via mpesa and uh, every seed we are sowing is going towards the payment of this auditorium whatever god is laying in your heart to do because of this auditorium where we gather at ecc nairobi i want you to release it as you release what is in your hands god is releasing releasing what is in his hands. I'm seeing a 48 hour miracle for every seed sower in this service. I want you to come and touch the altar. Beginning with this side. Okay, let's begin with this side. Then we'll go to this side. Amen. You made a way When my back goes against the wall and it looked as if it was over you made a way now i'm standing here only because you made because you move mountains and you cause walls to fall with your power you perform there is nothing, nothing that's impossible. I am standing here only because you made and you move mountains. Ah, you cause walls to fall with your power. That's 
just what you do. You perform miracles. There is nothing that's impossible. Now we're standing here only because you made. You move, you move mountains, and you cause walls to fall with your power. You do, you do, you perform miracles. There is nothing, absolutely nothing, that's impossible. Now Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Can we hear some testimonies very quickly? Mama Oracle, we have a testimony here from Brenda Akinyi. She says, the God of this commission has done me well. The Oracle of God located me in the service a couple of months ago and say that the battle is over and she released a promotion my way. The same week I was shortlisted for an interview and the same month of April I emerged the best. She says after 12 long years of stagnating in one position I received my promotion and I have now assumed a bigger and better position. Jesus, yes. you move mountains. Brenda, come. Amen. You cause yes. worlds to fall with your power. That's what you do. You perform miracles. There is nothing. Yes, give us the testimony. My God. Somebody say, I am the next testifier. Uh-huh. Praise God, church. Amen. I've seen God in this commission. Mm. Mama Oracle, I honor the grace Amen. of your life. Ever since I committed to be a daughter of Mama Oracle, my life has never been the same. This year, it's been testimonies after testimonies after testimonies. And uh, the last time, Mama Oracle prophesied here before everyone. Mm. So I located you in the service. Yes. Uh huh. And uh, you talked about a number of things. And I can confirm that they've all come to pass. Somebody shout, fire! Fire! Uh huh. Yes, you said that you sing a promotion. It was in my heart that I be promoted, but I didn't know it would come this soon. Yeah. It surprised everybody, even my line manager, it was battle to release me and go to my new station and assume my role. The same week, Mama, you prophesied, I was shortlisted for an interview, and I had the best in that interview that now every station was fighting. Yeah. Somebody say, I am the next testifier. I am the next testifier. And when I came to your office so that you can release me to this role, uh -huh. Mama, you also spoke a number of words. But on Monday, the 5th of June, I reported to Karen Branch. Mm -hmm. It's a premier center bigger than where I was before, a better role in management. And the same day, the first deal I got, Mama, it was my target for the month of June. Yeah. Somebody shout fire! Yeah. Promotion does not come from yeah. the east or from the west. Come on. It comes from the Lord. Yeah. As God did it for her, Jesus. from this altar of yeah. fire, from this altar of testimony, oh. receive your promotion. Receive. receive your promotion. Receive. receive your elevation. Receive. receive your lifting. You will meet your targets. Amen. You will achieve your goals. Amen. Take it. I take it now. Uh huh. And Mama, the same day when your prophecy you mentioned my children. Uh huh. Since last year, April, I've been away from my children. A young boy of two and a half years, I left them behind. A young girl of three years was left behind. But when I received the good news to go to a new position, my ex-family has agreed to give me my children. Yeah. Glory to Jesus. Restoration. Restoration. Whatever you lost is coming back. Oh, yes. I said it's coming back. It's coming back. Anything that was taken yeah. from you, My God. as God has done it 
for her. Yeah, I said it's coming back. It's I'll coming back. Shout fire! Fire! fire. Hey. Thank you so much, Mama. Amen. I'm a proud daughter. Amen. May heaven honor you, my Amen. daughter. And may your star continue to shine. You are your promotion is permanent your elevation is permanent as for you and your children yes. you are blessed and lifted Amen. you will go from glory to glory Amen. power to power yes. strength to strength oh, yes. when men say there is a casting down as for you and your household there shall be a lifting up Amen. in Jesus name Amen. somebody shout fire fire my God Mama Oracle we have another testimony here from Adeo Susan, she says, I am from South Sudan. I came this week on Tuesday to meet my doctor. I have suffered from degenerative disc of the spinal cord and I've had two surgeries so far, but no change. Before I came, I had difficulties in sitting, walking, bending and couldn't sleep without an injection for pain management. For the past two years, I have been on injections morning and evening. My God. She says, I attended the PhD service on Friday and after the Oracle of God left, my sister Dorcas asked me to sit on the chair of the Oracle and I did. And that Friday. Hey, power. Yeah. Power. Yeah. Oh. Oracle of uh -huh. miracles. Power. Oh God. She says that Friday I slept and woke up the following day at 5.30 p.m. A kind of sleep that I have not slept for more than two years. Mama Oracle, she says, for the past three days, I haven't taken any painkillers. I am completely Fire. 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 Tell your neighbor what? Not to what God, God cannot, cannot do. does not exist. Does, does not, not exist. exist. Somebody say, I am a seed of mercy. I, I am a seed of mercy. I cannot, I cannot be destroyed. I cannot be destroyed. I will survive. I will survive. Where are you? My miracles God. are miracles. Yeah. Mama, Oracle. Uh -huh. Mama Oracle, without touching her, she has received her miracle. And right now she says she's scheduled for surgery on the 22nd of June, but she says, I believe the God of the Oracle. That's Somebody shout fire. fire! Fire! Give her the mic, we want to hear. My God, sit down. Jesus. Yeah! Praise yes. God, church. Amen. I'm from South Sudan. Uh-huh. I've been a member, an online member of this church. Uh-huh. I follow Mama Oracle on all the platforms, starting from Twitter, Facebook, TikTok, everything online church you are blessed as god has brought her to ecc you are coming to testify in the name of jesus I will it. my god i've been suffering from a degenerative disc disease for more than three years and when i visited the doctor the first time he said you're too young i'm 33 years old he was like this sickness is for somebody from 50 above and i had two different surgeries 2020 and 2021, but no uh, change, Mama Oracle. I've been on a strong painkiller for two good years, morning and evening. I could not sleep without taking an injection. When I came here on Tuesday, uh, Pastor Monica has been my pastor in South Sudan for over 10 years. We stayed together and I called her that mom picked me at the airport I have an appointment with my doctor. That day I came, I never slept. They were all there in the house. I stayed the whole night, like a night dancer. People were sleeping, I was awake, moving, pacing up and down. She came to the church and met our senior mom and some of the intercessors. They prayed for me. That night, when it was approaching 5.30, that's when I had a little nap. And on Friday, we came here to church. I was seated right there. And I said, if others can get their miracles, today is my day. And the sermon of Friday, it was like it was meant for me because she said, this day, just this one day, mm. believe God and every situation Jesus. that you are going through, my God. today is the end. I wanted to meet her, but she said, 
I'm not seeing anybody today because I have a Zoom meeting. So after the service, I was standing here for a photograph with mom. And my sister Dorcas pulled me and said, do you believe in miracles? Sit on the chair of the oracle. Power! My Come God! On. Today when I was jumping behind there, mom was looking at me saying, don't jump pain. I was like, I don't have pain. Somebody said no more pain. No, no more, more pain. pain. I couldn't pain. Hey. 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 Somebody shot fire. Somebody shot fire. Jesus. God of the oracle. I've been asking myself, should I still go for the surgery on 22nd? I was thinking about it the whole night. And I said, no, this Sunday, it's the end for this, whatever that is in my birth. Oh, yes. Can you stretch your hands towards her? <laughs> this is such a powerful testimony. And we thank God for Pastor Monica. She was uh, previously in South Sudan for more than uh, 10 years. And we give God the glory. This is so wonderful. And also, we thank God. So you landed on Tuesday, but Friday was your first service here. Yeah. Service. That was your first service. And after you sat on that chair, the pain ceased. It disappeared. I never took any painkillers. And you slept? From Friday night to Saturday, 5.30 p.m. My God! When is the last time you had that kind of a sleep? Two years ago. Somebody shout fire! Fire! Stretch your hands towards her. Oh, Shalabraska. I declare your healing is permanent. Amen. Your healing is permanent. Amen. Your healing is permanent. Bring Amen. the oil. My God. Your healing is permanent. Shalabroska magadesh kalabragados. Zegedesh kalabragados. Ziparagadesh kalabraska. Father, by your stripes we are healed. By the virtues of Christ we are made whole. I decree and declare. Be healed from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Jesus. Go back and get tested again. It is done. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Your healing is permanent. Somebody shout, it is permanent. It is permanent. Give the Lord a clap offering Glory as you take your seat. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Somebody say, I'm the next testifier. I'm the next testifier. And even those that are watching online, you're the next testifier. Father, I bless every seed sower, every giver that has given towards this auditorium. I speak the blessing and the favor of God upon your life. I decree and I declare in the name of Jesus, right now, le paragadoska, ziparagadeshka labraske. As you have released what is in your hands, may God release what is in his hands in the name of Jesus. I'm seeing major financial breakthroughs. Somebody look, lift up your hands. Say financial breakthrough. The kind of money you have never touched, you will touch it this June. Somebody, God is compelling your destiny. Help us to help you. Amen. Somebody, I see a check being written with your name on it. Amen. Somebody, I see your money that was held being released. I am seeing a financial breakthrough. Amen. Major financial breakthrough. I, I provoke the angels of money. Yes. This week I declare it's a week of financial I breakthrough. It is a week of abundance. Your bills will be paid. Yes. Your debts will be cancelled. I saw financial breakthroughs. Yes. My God. Le paragadoska. Take it in the name of Jesus. Somebody say I take it. I take it. Thank you Holy Ghost. Today as I was in prayer... And I was asking the Lord in this weekend of mercy. The Lord gave me a prophetic word that I know is a word for somebody. The Lord told me he's going to deliver everyone that is under spiritual attack. Somebody says spiritual attack. Spiritual attack. And I want to give you seven signs uh, of a person that is under spiritual attack. Number one. Loss of spiritual desire. Somebody say loss of spiritual desire. Loss of spiritual desire. In Psalms 37 and verse 4, the Bible says, Delight yourself also in the Lord, and he shall give you all the desires of your heart. People that uh, are under, uh, under spiritual attack, they lose that spiritual desire. They lose that spiritual desire in the things of God for prayer, going to the house of God. Somebody look at your neighbor, tell them neighbor. Ah, say neighbor. Be delivered from every attack. 
be delivered from every attack. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. When there is a loss of spiritual desire, that means you don't have passion. You don't have hunger for the things of God. You look for different activities and other forms of things that take the place of God in your life. You don't pay attention to the things of God like you used to before. Before you could not miss a service. Before you could not miss to pray. But now you have lost the desire. You can even sleep without prayer. You can even miss a service just to go home and watch Netflix. Netflix and chill. Salami amtu mwambia shetani ya shindwe mfululizo. Shetani ya shindwe. Today I am going to pray for deliverance on anyone here and anyone watching that is under spiritual attack. The loss of spiritual desire. From today I declare you will delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires of your heart in the name of Jesus. Amen. Another sign of somebody that is under spiritual attack is lack and stagnation. Somebody say lack and stagnation. Lack and stagnation. In Judges chapter 6, when the Israelites were under attack, the Midianites would allow them to plant. But when it came for their time of harvest, they would attack and carry all their harvest. They found themselves planting but not harvesting. You know, you have labor that is not producing. My God, this is an indication that the enemy wants to keep you down. So you encounter lack and you cannot be fruitful. Somebody say lack and stagnation. Lack and Lift stagnation. up your hand and say you spirit of lack and stagnation. You spirit of lack, lack and stagnation. You spirit of working and not producing. You spirit of working, working and, and not, not producing. Catch fire. Catch, Catch fire. fire. Number three. A weak prayer life. Somebody say a weak prayer life. A weak prayer life. In Matthew 26, 40, the Bible says, Then he came to the disciples and found them sleeping and said to Peter, What? Can you have that scripture on screen? I want us to read it together. Weak prayer life. Please ask your neighbor, how is your prayer life? How is your prayer life? <laughs> ask two people, how is your prayer life? How is your prayer life? Are you listening to me? Because your prayer life is an indication of your spiritual life. Ask two people, how is your prayer life? How is your prayer life? Uh-huh. Then he came to the disciples and found them sleeping and said to Peter, what? Tell your neighbor, what? What? Uh, can, can you look at two people? Ask them, what? 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 Could you not watch with me one hour? Could you not watch with me? Uh, could you not watch with me one hour? When your prayer life becomes weak, you lose strength. You don't have spiritual vigor. You find yourself not able, you know, even to focus. Some of you, uh, the longest prayer you can pray is 30 seconds. Today, may God ignite your prayer life with fire. Amen. I said, may God soak you in the spirit of prayer. Amen. Amen. If you find yourself unable to pray, it means the enemy is attacking you and wants to keep you down since prayer is your way to break through and divine assistance may God soak you in the spirit of prayer Amen. may God ignite your prayer life with fire Amen. receive the spirit of prayer and intercessory I receive. I receive somebody say I receive I receive I receive another sign you are under spiritual attack is uh, feeling helpless and overwhelmed. You feel helpless and overwhelmed. Helpless and overwhelmed. You are surrounded by affliction. You are overwhelmed by situation. You are under constant uh, attack from the enemy. You have no place to run. You find you have no strength. You feel, ask your neighbor, are you feeling helpless and overwhelmed? Are you Please ask your neighbor, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Are you under a spiritual attack? Ask your neighbor, are you overwhelmed? Are you overwhelmed? And band, I can't hear you. Are you overwhelmed? Are you overwhelmed? Please ask two people, are you overwhelmed? Are, are you, you overwhelmed? overwhelmed? I love what Psalm 61 2 says. When my heart is overwhelmed. Can I have it? Psalm 61 2. Psalm 61 2. How, what is your neighbor saying? Are they overwhelmed? Mwambia shetani ya shindwe mfululizo. Shetani ya shindwe mfululizo. It says from the end of the earth. I will cry to you when my heart is overwhelmed. Lead me to the rock that is higher than I. Somebody say, Oh Lord. Oh Lord. When my heart is overwhelmed. When my heart is overwhelmed. Lead me to the rock. Lead me to the rock. That is higher than I. That is higher than I. Number five, the fifth indication you are under spiritual attack. When old habits, old lifestyles, and patterns begin to resurface again, ask your neighbor, neighbor. Neighbor. Our old habits, our old habits, lifestyles, lifestyles and, patterns and patterns resurfacing again in your life. Resurfacing in your life. My God, Galatians 5 1 says, 
Can I have Galatians 5.1? When you're under spiritual attack, you start having old cravings. Old habits, you know, reappear in your life. My God. But today we are cutting you off in the name of Jesus. Amen. It says, stand fast therefore in the liberty by which Christ has made us free. And do not be entangled again with the yoke of bondage. Tell your neighbor, don't be entangled again. Don't be, don't be entangled again. If God delivered you from alcoholism, don't go back there. If God delivered you from addictions and all kinds of addictions and old habits, touch three people, tell them, don't go back again. Don't, don't go, go back. Don't again. be entangled. If God delivered you, tell your neighbor, Usi Rudi Numa, Usi Rudi don't Numa. go back again. Don't go back again. Amen. Hey, ask your neighbor, are you under spiritual attack? Are you are you under spiritual spiritual tell your neighbor, attack? I can sense you are under spiritual attack. I can sense you under Because spiritual. some of you are going back to old habits, but God will deliver you. Somebody say, oh Lord, deliver me. Oh Lord, oh Lord show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. The sixth one. How to know you are under spiritual attack? When you begin to pull away from godly relationships you find right now you are just surrounded by sinners. Now you are pulling away from all godly relationships. You begin to find fault with the church and with the believers. Every time you are finding fault with the church, with the believers. And I said the other day, we don't have any perfect church because we don't uh, pastor perfect people. The people we are pastoring is you and me who are imperfect. And a church is like a hospital. Not everyone is responding to treatment. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor. Neighbor. Are you pulling away? Are you pulling away from godly relationship? From godly relationship. Are you listening to me? When you look at 2 Timothy chapter 4 and verse 10, Paul stated that demons had forsaken him. This was an indication of a spiritual attack. You start to disconnect yourself. You disconnect yourself from the altar. You disconnect yourself from your covering. You start even to be familiar. You know, familiarity neutralizes the anointing. Look at your neighbor, tell them, don't disconnect yourself. Don't, don't disconnect, disconnect yourself. Look at your neighbor say, don't disconnect yourself. Don't, don't disconnect, disconnect yourself. yourself. We also see in the garden of Eden, Adam used to enjoy fellowship with God until when his disobedience came and he began to pull away and hide from God. Touch two people, tell them, don't disconnect yourself. Don't disconnect yourself. Don't disconnect yourself. Many people disconnect themselves and they forget what you got by prayer, you sustain by prayer. What you got by prayer, you sustain by prayer. Look at your neighbor, tell them, don't disconnect yourself. Don't, don't disconnect, disconnect yourself. yourself. The seventh one, and we pray. Losing appetite for the word of God. Ask your neighbor, do you have an appetite for the word of God? Do you, do you have, have an appetite, appetite for the word, word of God? God? How many people here go back to YouTube and you are watching the same message that I was preaching here for understanding, for clarity, for depth? How many people follow messages or you are just on Netflix and show marks? Ask your neighbor, neighbor. Neighbor. Ah, how is your word life? How is your word life? Ah, please ask two people, how is your word life? How is your word life? Because you cannot give the word of God its place and you miss your place. The word of God is the life of God. The word of God is the power of God. Yes. The word of God is the wisdom of God. Amen. Amen. In Psalms 119 and verse 9. Psalms 119 verse 9. Put it on screen for me. The word of God is your food. It's your guidance. It's your source of strength. It's your place of hope. It's your encouragement. It's where you get the truth to set you free. Let's see this. How can a young man cleanse his ways? By taking heed according to your word. Is that the new King, J King James Version? How shall a young man, how shall a young man uh, keep his ways pure? By taking heed to the word of God. Amen. I wanted the new, please make sure media, all the scriptures you give me should always be in New King James Version. Can we read it together? Somebody say, how can a young man cleanse his ways? How, how can, can a young man, man cleanse, cleanse his ways? Or keep his ways pure? Or keep, keep his, his ways pure? Somebody say, by taking heed. By, by taking heed. heed. Uh, to the word of God. To the word of God. Tell your neighbor, the word of God. The word of God. It's your food. It's your food. It's your guidance. It's your guidance. It's your source of strength. It's your source of strength. It's your place of hope. It's, it's your place, place of, of it's your place of encouragement. It's your place, place of, of encouragement. encouragement. And I'm praying for somebody here. May your appetite for God's word 
increase and not decrease. Amen. Because some of you, unless you are in church, that's, this is the only place you hear the word. But I want you to have an appetite for God's word. That after every service, you go back to Facebook, you go back to YouTube, you rewatch the messages from your spiritual mother. You take time before you sleep. Open the Bible. Read at least a chapter or a scripture. Look at your neighbor. Tell them, neighbor, receive Amen. appetite for God's word. Receive appetite, appetite for, for God's, God's word. So if you find that your appetite for God's word is, is decreasing, it's an attack that wants you to remain in darkness and in bondage. And don't allow anyone or anything to take you away from your destiny. Can we be upstanding in the name of Jesus? I want to pray one prayer for everybody. Stretch your hands. If you're under spiritual attack, just open your just open your mouth and say, Oh Lord, deliver me. Oh Lord, oh Lord show me mercy. Oh Lord, show me mercy. Show me mercy. Show me mercy. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Oh Lord, show me mercy. Shalabras kamagadesh. Zegedesh kalabras. Open your mouth. Zegedesh kalabras. Zuse frankutai. Zogodosh. Zalabras. Zalabras. Rahazole Kiske, Zegele Masofria, Zala Braska Magadesh, Ariato Sia, Zola Braska Magadesh, Zele Masofraki, Zele Brasia, Zegedesh, Calabras, La Paragados, Magadesh, Somebody say, Lord, ignite my prayer life with fire. Lord, ignite my prayer. Soak me in the spirit of prayer. Soak me in the spirit of prayer. Disconnect me from old habits. Disconnect all patterns. It's old cycles, old lifestyles. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Somebody open your mouth. In Jesus' name. Father, I pray for everyone here and everyone watching. Lord, I pray today for anyone under spiritual attack. Yes. I pray for your deliverance. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we repent sins of commission. Yes. Sins of omission, assumption, and presumption. Yes, Lord. Forgive us, O oh God. Yes. Deliver us from all forms of spiritual attacks. Yes, Lord. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Lord, we are available and we want to be used by you as vessels of honor. Amen. Somebody say, oh Lord. Oh, oh Lord. I avail myself. I avail to myself. be used by you. To be used as by a you. vessel of honor. As a vessel of honor. And in this junction, if you you're here or you're watching us live you've not received Jesus as your Lord and Savior this is the greatest of all miracles the miracle of salvation I want you to pray this prayer I know the believers help them pray this prayer because if you're not saved you are not safe if you're not in Christ you are in crisis I want you to pray this prayer say Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I am a sinner I, am a sinner. I receive you today I receive you as today. my Lord and Savior as my Lord and write my name in the book of life write my name in the book wash of life. me with your blood wash, wash me with your blood. blood receive me as your child receive me as your child from today, from today, I am born again. I am born again. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. You may be seated in God's presence. Please, if you are here, you are a tither. You need an envelope very quickly. If you are here, you are a tither. You need an envelope. Lift up your hands so that our kingdom hostess can bring an envelope right where you are. If you are writing a check, make it payable to Empowerment Christian Church. If you're giving on your mobile device, there's a kingdom hostess with the PDQ machine. If you're watching us live, you have your tithe, you have your partnership, you're watching us from anywhere in the world, you can give on PayPal, on Wave via M-Pesa, you can give uh, uh, on the ministry banking details, all the details are on your screen. They are pinned on the caption of this live broadcast and on the comment section. I want you to release your tithe. When you give God what belongs to him, he keeps the devil from touching what belongs to you. Your tithe, your tithe is your foundation of prosperity. It is your tithe that brings judgment to the enemy of your prosperity. It is your tithe that rebukes the devourer. Devourers are eaters of finances. Your tithe is a weapon. Please make your way to the altar. If you are here, you have your tithe or you are watching us live, release your tithe on this altar. Distance is not a barrier.
area in the realm of the spirit. I want to pray for every tither. Just make your way to the altar. Shalabros kamagadesh kalagraske. Zegedesh kalabraske. You are here, you are a tither. Come in Jesus' name. I want to declare the blessing of God upon your life. I want to declare the blessing of God upon your life. You are here, you are a tither. I want to declare the blessing of God upon your life. Shalabros kamagadesh. You are here, you are a tither. Come. In the name of Jesus. You are here, you are a tither. You are watching us live. It is your tithe that brings judgment to the enemy of your prosperity. Come to the altar in the name of Jesus. Shalabros kamagadesh. Lord, I thank you for every tither. I pray for the tither's blessing. May God rebuke the devourer on your behalf. May your pockets never go dry. May whatever you touch with your hands increase and multiply. I speak over the tithers here and those that are watching us live. Receive the tithers blessing. Go and prosper. Go and succeed. Go and excel in Jesus name. Amen. You may touch the altar. God bless you. God bless you tithers. Go and prosper. Go and succeed. In the name of Jesus, go and prosper. Go and succeed in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Can we all be upstanding on our feet? God bless you, tithers. Hold your phone, your documents, the pictures of your loved ones. I had said today was the anointing service. But the Spirit of God said to me tomorrow, as I'm finishing this weekend of mercy in the Miracle Monday, the Lord says, have the anointing service. And also release the anointed water tomorrow for healing. Tomorrow, look at your neighbor, tell them, miss at your own risk. Risk. tomorrow's miracle monday is going to be so powerful and explosive today we have spent so much time in the prophetic but tomorrow also it is going to be so powerful and life-changing it is a weekend of mercy don't miss tomorrow. God has mandated me to anoint each one of you. And also we are going to be giving the anointed water. is free of charge. Today I was supposed to meet the stewards after the service. But we have said it is the heads of department that will meet the, uh, every all the stewards that are serving in various departments will only meet their heads of department. And we've prepared some refreshments for you. So make sure if you are a steward, it, the, meet, the meeting is going to take uh, uh, 15 minutes but it is going to be the heads of department meeting the people in that department. If you're in media, meet your head of department. If you're in kingdom hostess, if you're in the hospitality, if you're in the worship team, just meet your, just for briefing and the Lord God will bless you in the name of Jesus. So today, we don't have the official gathering of all the, all the, all the stewards. Amen. So let's ensure we just meet our heads of department and eat something together for fellowship. Tell your neighbor, fellowship and swallowship and the, uh, the 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 department of intercessory is going to be briefed by the pastoral amen so i want you also to keep me in prayer i've been in prayer and fasting and i need energy and strength amen but i'm renewed and recharged somebody say fire, fire. fire. somebody say fire. fire amen so just stretch your hands to the altar father every word i've spoken in this altar Confirm it with miracle signs and wonders. Yes. Father, I pray that you will confirm your word. Anyone that was under spiritual attack here or live, I pray in the name of Jesus. Yes. Father, remember them and deliver them. As we come for the miracle Monday service tomorrow, I pray in the name of Jesus that the lives of the people will never ever be the same again in the name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Father, we worship you. We bless you. As your people leave this place, I send them out with your blessing, with your favor. If you're here, you are going back to a rented house or you're watching us, living in a rented house. That will be your last house to rent. Amen. From that house, you are going to your own house. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. If you are here in this service, you are not driving. I decree and declare, before this year is over, receive your own personal means of transport. I receive. If 
receive your driving, receive an upgrade. I Anyone receive. that is out of employment, receive a high paying permanent job. I Anyone receive. that is in debt, I pray for supernatural debt cancellation. Amen. Anyone that needs financial breakthrough, yes. Yes. may God supply all your needs yes. according to his riches in glory through Christ Jesus. Amen. I bless you in the name of the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. So hold your phone, your documents, the pictures of your loved ones, and uh, today has been the last day of uh, my prayer and fasting, so also keep me in prayer in the name of Jesus. I sense it. God is taking us to the next level. Somebody said the next level. The next Look level. at your neighbor, tell them the next level. The so next as you are saying a prayer today, make sure you also say a prayer for your pastor. Look at your neighbor, tell them, say a prayer for your pastor. Say a prayer, a prayer for your pastor. In the name of Jesus. As I pray for you also today, make sure you say a prayer to the glory of God. Amen. I sense it. God is about to do something supernatural in ECC over your life, over your family. So tomorrow, I need to pray for each one of you as I anoint you. The mercy of God will speak for you in the remaining days of this year and beyond in the name of Jesus. So it is going to be an anointing service and we are also going to be releasing the anointing water to the glory of God. Amen. Hold your phone, your documents, the pictures of your loved ones. Amen. Shalabroska magadeshka. I also feel in the spirit, though I want to close, but I'm hearing in the spirit, I need to pray for somebody like Josiah. There is a land that was taken from your family that God is bringing back. I'm hearing like Josiah, Josiah. Josiah, 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 I need to pray for you. I need to speak over your life. Josiah, 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 Shalabroska. Just stretch your hands towards him. What is your name? Josiah. Josiah. Shalabroska. What is this thing I'm seeing about land? Because I'm seeing contention in the realm of the spirit. This land was grabbed by our neighbors some years back, almost 30 years back. It was grabbed. So is there an ongoing case? There's an ongoing case. Stretch your hands. Anyone that is sitting on your land illegally, yes. I create an agency in the realm of the spirit for them to release it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Because I saw contention with land contention with land and the lord said he's going shalabroska nobody will take your inheritance stretch your hands towards him and anyone here that has any land case any issue any case to do with land i decree and declare is settled i was about to close the service but the lord said anyone here with any land issue the lord is intervening on your behalf Amen. any any battle in court or wherever it is, it shall be won in your favor. Le pragados kalagras kamagadesh kalabragados ziparagadeshka. The Lord is intervening, and the Lord is healing your father. Where is your father sick? Uh, he has a sight problem. He has a what? A sight problem. A sight problem. Yeah. Come closer. Bring the oil as I anoint you. I decree and declare, I use you as a point of contact for your father and for this land. I hear the Lord say, it is coming back. As I anoint your hands, you have been working without producing. I'm seeing delays and stagnation, but the Lord says no more delays. No more. Between now and September, I am seeing a 360 degree turnaround. Amen. Your life will be different. God is going to give you strategic alliances and partnership. God is going to compel your destiny helpers to help you. You have been surrounded by glory, but you have not been a partaker of the glory. I decree and declare, your days of seeing what you want and unable to achieve it are over. Amen. I declare, you will see it and you will be a partaker. It's done in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Hold your phone, your documents. Father, I speak over every phone, over every document, over the pictures of your loved one. I speak good news on every phone. Good news on calls, on emails, good on news. WhatsApp. Good news. Good news. In the name of Jesus, in our bank 
accounts. Good news. In our Mpesa accounts. Good, Good news. news. Good news in the name of Jesus. Good news. Good news from home and abroad. Good, Good news. news. Good news. In the name of Jesus, good news. I release good news right now. Shalabros, Kamagadesh, Kalabras. I receive every document. I declare favor, 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 favor. Every document I decree and declare, whether it is a CV, yes. whether it is a, a bank card, Rabros, Kamagadesh. And tomorrow, if you have a passport, I want to pray. I want to touch your passport. I carry a grace for nations. The Lord is saying tomorrow touch every passport. People that are believing God for international doors yes. also carry your passport tomorrow. I need to speak over that passport. There is mercy. Mercy. There is a wind of mercy. There is a flow of mercy. There are international doors that are open right now. Yes. In the name of Jesus. As you are leaving this place, may the angels of this house go with you. Amen. May the angels of prosperity, yes. angels of favor, yes. angels of preservation go yes. with you. May God clothe you with his favor. Amen. With his power and his glory. Amen. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. To those that are watching us live. Our Miracle Monday service is at 5pm. At ECC Nairobi. We are located at Biashara Plaza building. Rooftop. At the junction of Moy Avenue. And Biashara Street. Shalom, shalom. Can we share the words of the grace? Lucy Natasha Kamer. A woman gifted and anointed. With a strong prophetic unction. In destiny changing Monday. I speak as an oracle. Whatever the devil has yes, taken from you, God. from your family, from your children, Jesus. I declare restoration. To deliver, equip, and empower people with the love of God. Your joy is coming back. Yes. Your health is coming back. Yes. Encounter the prophetic. Can 